Hey YouTube, today we're going for the single city victory on Deity. There are a lot of good choices for a single city victory. Greek, Spanish, um, it's hard to say no to 50% gold in the industrial era. Because mainly you're probably going to be going for an economic victory. Early democracy is pretty nice too, though. So I could see uh, Aztecs, a couple others. Well, let's go with the Greek and see how it goes. It's going to be ugly, I'm going to tell you right now. It's a challenge for a reason. There's going to be legions. All kinds of units marching all over my trees. There's not gonna be much I can do about it except just trying to kill them as much as I can. The computer doesn't really relent until you strike back and take their cities, and that's when they get scared. But uh, in this case, hopefully, I can just hide in the corner of the map, and maybe they'll just leave me alone for a really long time. It looks like I'm in the north, so maybe I can run even more north. And just hide. In the northern south southern parts of the map, you, you would find more whales and stuff like that too. Like this is actually a pretty good spot right here. Mm. Barely any trees though. Oh, thank you. That's pretty amazing. So what we've got here, we've got fish, a whale, two die, and thankfully two trees. And I'm in a corner. Only downside is this hills right here. But you can make plans for that. That's not that's not a deal breaker. You can put your own defensive units up there and just never lose that spot. The only problem is it's really tough to get any production going here. I have no mountains. It's going to be very rough. I'd say just get out a couple warriors. Just go for technology. Try to get as much money as I can here. Me a little rough because I had to run back into a corner. All right, looks like I can get a hut over here. Hopefully, oh, there goes the auto turn. I hate that. So the question is, how many huts should I get? Nah, it's how many warriors. It'd be nice to get a boat. Yes, let's get a boat. Damn shame. Hopefully there's a lot of artifacts, because I'm going to need all of them. Every last one. He is busted up. I gotta let this guy finish him off. Well, 
I gotta be quick about this. for the boat. We need a fish. We need the fish. So let's go bronze working first. I need every advantage I can get. This is just going to be completely painful. I can't figure out where the ocean is right now. Around here, somewhere. So, let's go this way. Fifty fifty shot. You're playing single city, you're gonna have to micromanage all of your all of your tiles as well as you can. It's often not really worth it if you have a giant army in like 15 cities, but when you only have one, you gotta do your best. Man, look at that. That's another nice spot right there. Thank you. You. See if I can guess this. I don't know. Maybe here. Think right here. Oh. oh, found the Romans. Some interesting looking islands over here. I'm gonna switch this back, get some production out of this for one turn so I don't overflow too much. Just keep exploring, I think. At some point, I'm going to pull that guy back, though. Now, the next most important thing is getting the alphabet going. Looks like someone's been here. the Americans. Nice. Not sure that'll help me since I already have democracy. Give me some culture. Not gonna help me. Culture will be good though. Anything I can get at this point. So, it looks like this has been pretty well explored. I'm going to 
gonna take a few more peeks and send that guy back. These are awesome islands if I was going to do an expansion game. The goal right now is to get 100 gold. So I can rush a library. Complete waste. Well, I'm glad I ran down here. Gonna need that since I'm not really getting what I need quite yet. Let's circle around this way. Nice. Ah. The Arabs. I can sell them the technology. Nice. Well, found the Arabs. I'm not going to mess with them right now. Could be a problem. Don't want to see some fundamentalist legions marching into my city. Let me change this. Just in case it feels like giving me a free technology again. Alright, great. So, gonna have to settle this guy in my city since I'm not expanding at all. And a few more rules I'm not taking over enemy cities or any. The only thing I can do is if I accidentally culture flip someone, but that's not happening with my positioning. So, one city, that's it. No, no loopholes, no tricks. Uh, so, let's just join the city and that should just give me some more food. <clears throat> Both paying off, so that's good. Gonna build the library. That's why I have nothing really. So there we go. Be nice to get the Colossus. There's too many hammers though. Too many hammers. Okay. Pretty nice map.
not going to mess with the Aztecs. Just going to continue exploring, try to get as much of these island relics and landmarks I can get. Um, very close to three population. Three population. Great. So, 18 technology. That's going to help a lot. Three more relics somewhere. All right, nothing left there. Nice. Oh, I have to get that. I'm gonna have to get navigation, that's just way too far. A lot of awesome little islands right there. Considering rushing a hoplite, but is it worth it? I think it may be. I may need him sooner than I think. More great people. Consider and go on this route just to get that extra the wall and the extra population. Could be a mistake, but I just think that extra population would be so nice right now. I have a feeling this isn't well explored down here. So I'm going to see if I can find some more stuff.
Even a barracks would be pretty nice to have. In fact, I may... Damn. Should have done it the last turn, though. Now it's going to be so expensive. I got the wall, though, so... Thankfully I got that. 